Brittany here. Welcome back to Have It or Leave It. Last week, we challenged ourselves to do 25 squats a day. Here's a quick recap. All right, I have a few minutes before I'm gonna have lunch, so here we go. It's the first day of our squat challenge and I'm gonna try to do 25 in a row. At the end of the week, I asked, have it or leave it? And the response that came back was a unanimous habit. Even my husband, who at the beginning of the week said he didn't like squats, by the end of the week had changed his tune. And we figured out it's because he had never been doing them correctly. So once he had the proper form, his knees didn't hurt, and he could feel the muscles in his legs activating and getting stronger. And he even said, yeah, I'm gonna keep doing them because then when I wanna go skiing or I wanna go hiking, I don't have to worry about feeling so sore the following couple of days. And that really brings us back to why we started this challenge, to retain our functional mobility as we get older. And at a minute and a half a day, I don't think that's a high price to pay. So this week, I'm saying 25 squats, have it. And after you've done those 25 squats and you're all warmed up, that would be a great time to do our next challenge, the five stretches to make you look 10 years younger. All right, everybody. Thanks for squatting and happy stretching.